what do you take away? If I say the one thing you take away from Kansas City is what? That um, they're uh, 100% a viable three-peat uh, opportunity in front of them, and, and they have the horses to go get it. And they didn't even – they weren't even full complement last night. Hollywood Brown is – is at some point going to come back. And and I understand he hasn't had a career that is um, lit it up with the numbers, um, but he definitely can take the top of a defense off and create more problems that um, that Mahomes can take advantage of. And so, and and their defense looks just as good as last year. Chris, uh, Chris Jones is uh, the, the Hall of Famer that's on their team that uh, nobody really talks about. So um, you you could take that away from the Chiefs last night for sure. All right. The one takeaway with the Ravens is? Is that they're just as good as last year, and that may just be one toe shy of being good enough. You know, I mean, that, that – um, a couple of times I was just wondering why they just went away from, from um, Derrick Henry last night. Um, and especially since their first drive of the game, they had six – runs from a running back in the AFC championship game loss. And that was definitely one of those moments that uh, you're, you're going to be scratching your head about for the rest of your football lives. And they handed the ball to Henry five times in the first drive. And I thought, okay, th- you know, let's check this box. They saw their problem from last year. They fixed it with one of the all time best. And, um, and, and he did not have many carries the rest of the game. But that, that said, the Ravens can absolutely on any given AFC championship Sunday beat the Chiefs. Um, they just didn't do it last night. And I think lost in the did he get in? Did he get was he out? Was Harbaugh was going for two. Yeah. Which yeah. I how do you what do you read into that that he's going for two? I know on the road you go for the win, but yeah. this felt playoff like. Yeah, it, it, and and you know with Belichick gone, he's the second most tenured coach in the NFL. So he's you know he's not looking over his shoulder to think what Steve Bashotti is going to think. And uh, clearly, you know when you have a one shot from the let me just check my notes here, two yard line uh, <laughs> to 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 win the game. <laughs> yeah, because we're in America. Yeah, we're in America. Yeah. Uh, the you know uh, the parts of North America where it's a two point conversion from the two. Um, that they, they, you do it, you take your shot. You, you don't leave Mahomes with the ball last. That's why the Niners aren't champions in many ways right now. Uh, that's why we didn't open up in Santa Clara last night. So I, I'm not surprised by it. It's the sort of thing that he's constantly done in his career. Uh, and, and, um, man, that was just the, the whole place went from, um, loud and buzzing with excitement. We're just being one play away for, the home team to win to completely silent to <laughs> Sean Hockley making everyone delighted with the announcement. Um, it, it was just great to be there last night.